My name's Sean. I've been, well, raised in Zambia my whole life. Uh, we work on Charter Our Farm as a family-run business here in Zambia. Our family's been in agriculture in Zambia for over 100 years. And we've been uh, working to produce crops to supply the Zambian market. We found that in Zambia you need to diversify. You can't focus on just one crop. So we do a lot of livestock farming as well as row crops and um, vegetables such as potatoes. And we find that by having a, a diverse range, you, you add balance to your, your business. We do animals, we do pigs, dairy cattle for milk, and then we also have beef cattle for the production of beef for the market in Zambia. If you're doing soya beans one year and maize price goes up, yes, do, you might do a little bit more maize, but keep your soya there. You need rotation in your crops. We moved to FMB in 2013 because we needed an agricultural bank who understood our business and was willing to support our business. And, and we got that from FNB. We approached the bank and said, told them the issues that we were facing. And they went and they came back with a proposal on how we could mitigate those problems and help to get through the hard times. And I'd like to say it, it has been a success for us and we thank you for that. We believe community development is a, a key thing for Zambia. If you don't support the people around you and the people that work for you, you can't expect to move forward in, in, in your industry. So as we, we've started a community school and we have a community football team that we support and um, I think they are playing in the super division now of our, our football team. I would like to see more support for farmers producing locally items that are imported. If someone in Zambia is growing something, let him market his product first before imports are allowed to come into the country. That way we can grow the business and it allows other people the time to say, okay, the market is there. I'm not going to get flooded with cheap imports at any stage because as we know, it, all it takes is one bad year and the farmer can lose his business and the employees lose their job.